Good morning. So in today's video, we're gonna be checking out big name thrift stores. I'm talking Goodwill and I'm talking Savers and I don't wanna waste any more time. Let's get to it. All right, we're at stop number one of Goodwill's today. We actually barely found a parking spot. So that's pretty good. That rarely happens here. Al, let's take a look inside, see what we find. All right, so that was a good find. Uh, it looked like somebody had just gotten rid of their entire Xbox collection and a lot of PS1 games, but they're all sports games. So I didn't take a look at those, but I did pick up some classics, a lot of Xbox stuff. I got Halo 2 for four bucks. So that's easily gonna sell. Picked up a couple more uh, Xbox 360 Halo games. This one was Halo Anniversary, which is a absolute classic and Halo 3 ODST with the Halo 3 multiplayer. All the discs looked pretty good. So $4 a, a game, a little bit higher, but it's still worth the gamble. This was a good one. Skate 3, uh, I know it's a Platinum Hits, uh, but it's still one of my favorite games of all time. Doesn't come with the book, but today was 50% off yellow tags. So for two bucks, this is super worth it. Now, of course, I had to pick up Puss in Boots. Look at this face. Just look at this face. I can't decline Puss in Boots. I also needed a game to test out Connects because I never got a Connect as a kid. So this was just uh, perfect timing for three bucks. All right, stop number two, here we go. Of course, the car starts. Ah, there it is. Stop number two, here we go. Stop number two, not a dub. Nothing really good going on there. It's kind of a, a, a toss up when you go this late in the day. Uh, if we would have gotten out of uh, jury duty on time, I might have, but you know, it wasn't how the cookie crumbled today. But we're gonna go find one more stop. Let's go do it. Okay, so stop number three, we had to wait a day. Uh, all the, the thrift stores closed, all of the good ones did, at least the name brand ones. And I had to go back home. There are no Goodwills, but there are a couple of savers, so let's hit those up instead. This is stop number three. That's no good. So yeah, that one was a failure. Uh, nothing really good in there. As you saw, there's only like three games. Uh, that MLB The Show was sealed. So I did take a second look at it because I didn't realize it was sealed at first. It's worth just <laughs> it's worth the price tag that was on it. So there's there's nothing we can do to flip that. Uh, there's surprisingly, you know, I checked through electronics, uh, jerseys, DVDs, all that. There's nothing good today. Uh, so as I try to back out of this space blindly, uh, but we got one more. And let's see what we can do. So I just got here. It's a fair amount of games. Sex is usually pretty good for games. Let's see what they got. Hmm. 
Okay, so I found a few games I'm going to check out, but the hard one about this savers is that every single one of them is wrapped, and I can't really get in, uh, at least with one hand, so I'm going to see what I can do with these. It's hard, it's hard to check condition, but these all have discs in them. So at least we're leaving with stuff. Let's go take a, uh, let's go find my car. Let's go take a look. Whew. Well, it just got toasty outside. It's been raining all day, but it just toasted up. Let me show you the finds that I found. Uh, so we got Disney Think Fast. This is paid four bucks. It's probably worth around five, but I'm gonna throw it in some whatnot auctions and see if it goes any better. Because for some reason on whatnot, things randomly sell really well. I don't know why. NHL 2K10. This one is about seven bucks it is worth. So again, throwing it up into a whatnot auction for the Nintendo auction coming up. I got Call of Duty 4 on PC. Uh, this was running around, you know, 10 bucks on eBay. So I'm, I'm gonna list it. I'm gonna just list that on eBay. And another game going around 10 right now was Civ 4. Yes, 4. I can't read in Roman numerals all that well sometimes. This one's also going for around 10 to 15 bucks. So, as long as the condition's good on these guys, I should be making probably 15 bucks a profit. And on the Wii games, we'll see what happens. Uh, it might be a toss up. But let's uh, go back to the house and I'll show you everything we got. So, to start it off, we have Halo 3 ODST along with that multiplayer disc that's currently running for about eight. I can probably uh, push the market up to 10. And then we have Halo Anniversary, which is running around 15 right now for an $11 profit. Skate 3 is currently trending. This Platinum Hits version around seven bucks, but I feel like it's worth more. I can probably push it. And for two and a half bucks, it's at least a $5 profit. Uh, then we also got Halo 2, which I've uh, constantly been able to sell for about 10. And then of course, Puss in Boots, but that's going, uh, let's go in the personal collection over there. So we'll just, there we go. That's nice. So take a look at some day two stuff. We did pick up NHL 2K10 uh, for some whatnot auctions and as well as Disney Think Fast. This is going for about six and a half, seven dollars, but I'll just throw it in on a whatnot auction. If you take a look at here, here's our back row first. This is something I got in an antique store this morning that I didn't show. I was uh, I actually didn't bring my phone with me, but it is Ratatouille for the PC. Two discs, both in great condition. I don't have a disc drive to test these on, but this one's already been thrown up on Mercari, so we'll see if it sells. And Call of Duty 4, which I didn't realize at first, it's a Mac DVD. So it only works on Macs. But these are running for about seven to ten dollars somewhere in there for like a duh, a nice little four dollar profit we'll see that might get thrown and whatnot as well and here is the holy grail of the day this was 50 cents grand theft auto san andreas <laughs> and i took a look inside and yes san andreas is there okay there it is i had it backwards the whole time there's san andreas uh we're gonna test this out now to see if it works because this could be like a ten dollar profit essentially let's go test it out So you never really know, but somewhere between 40 and $70 profit today. It's pretty good for someone who has no money. So I wanna thank all of you guys for coming with me today, checking out Goodwill and checking out Savers. Uh, we found some good things. I hope that uh, we turn a really good profit at the end of this. And again, if you guys want anything that you saw here uh, today, all of my links are over here, Mercari, eBay, whatnot. I haven't figured out what order they're in. And if you want to hit me up on social media, here's where you can find me on this side. And hopefully I edit all of that right. Thanks guys for watching and I'll see you guys, I don't know, next time.